my friends. So I'm your realtor. This is Heidi Turner with Choice Jacksonville Realty. And I'm out here at 215 Westfield Drive. This is the property that I told you about that is already under contract, but it's the coal floor plan built by Atlantic Construction. So I've uh, gone inside, I've taken a look at everything, I've flipped all of the lights on, turned, um, <laughs> flipped all of the lights on, opened up closet doors and stuff. So I'm gonna take you through what this floor plan looks like and see if we can get this one built in another subdivision. So here we go with the Atlantic Constructions, the coal floor plan. This would be the dining area. They've got the chair rail molding in there and crown molding at the top. Nice big foyer. The floors in here are laminate vinyl plank. And I'm not sure if that would be a standard feature in just any coal floor plan. It might have been something that this particular buyer chose. But there is carpet in all of the bedrooms. So as we are downstairs here, of course the master bedroom has vaulted ceilings and is on the first floor. This is vinyl floor in here. This is not ceramic tile. It might look that way in the video, but it is vinyl. All flat paint ceilings in this particular home. big walk-in closet with the window in the closet too that's kind of nice also vaulted ceilings in the living room giving it a really nice big feel Got an electric fireplace over here. This is not gas logs. Now this particular kitchen has a gas stove. This is probably an upgrade that this particular buyer has chosen. You do not see that standard in most new construction homes. And usually we have a refrigerator factored into the contract. There's also a dishwasher built in and microwave. Crown molding on these cabinets. That may have been an upgrade too. For mica countertops. All of the windows are double pane vinyl. Nice big pantry there. And just off of the, this would be like a breakfast area. You could put a table in there or not. But just off of that little breakfast area, 
you're going to have a half bath and then you're going to have a laundry closet here in this little space in between this area that does have a door to shut it out. And then that walks you right into the garage. The builders do give you a garage door opener for the most part. And that's where the water heater would go and the electrical panel. It's a little windy out today, so if you hear some creaking, that's where we're at. If we come back around here, as if we were going into the dining room, there's gonna be another closet there. And then right under the stairs, you've got another closet for the storage space. Take a look upstairs. Okay, now that we're at the top of the stairs, you can see to the left is the first bedroom here. First bedroom on the second floor anyway. This one's nice and deep, has three windows in it, and a double door garage, <laughs> double door. <laughs> Closet, not garage, excuse me. This neighborhood is out in Richlands, if I didn't mention that before. So I know this is a little bit farther than where you would want to be, but it's a great opportunity to see this floor plan. And I like this because this is a Jack and Jill bathroom. So we've got this entry door that comes from the hall. And then this goes right into this bedroom here. Nice high ceilings in these rooms. Plenty of space in here. And then a walk-in closet. And coming back out into the hallway, that's that door that goes to the bathroom again. And then we've got a nice big bedroom over here. Closets have lights in them, which is nice. And then in the hallway, we've got a linen closet right here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and walk downstairs and show you what the back of the house looks like. Here's a view from the top of the stairs what that living room looks like. All right, meet me downstairs. Okay, so this is the back of the home, the back of the coal floor plan, and just gives you an idea of how this builder finishes off. So this particular home is closing at the end of February. You can see there's an open patio, and you see how there's sod that has been laid around the perimeter of the home in the back. And on the side, the rest of the lot, they're more than likely this time of year going to lay something like winter ryegrass or some other kind of seed that will catch quickly. You can see right now there's a little bit of green coming through and it will be on the homeowner to nurture and maintain that backyard. So builders do not provide fences anymore either at closing unless you want to pay for it up front. But that is what the back of the home looks like. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this tour of the coal floor plan by Atlantic Construction. It's a beautiful floor plan.